Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you notice that I'm wearing the same clothes, is it because I just did my Dior, Sephora, and Ulta unboxing? I wanted to do two videos in one day today, so today we are going to be doing a decorating my apartment with me for Valentine's Day. I wanted to dedicate the Sunday to making videos for you all, so I hope you enjoy this video and I wanted to start off my video with, of course, a haul of what I got for Valentine's Day. In addition to decorating for Valentine's Day, I also wanted to decorate for Lunar New Year. The first thing I have is a bath bomb from Lush. It's in a rabbit-shaped bath bomb and it's in the most prettiest color. I don't remember what scent this is in. I usually don't see Lush come out with anything Lunar New Year, so I wanted to get it for this year. In my Dior unboxing, I showed you guys that I got these red envelopes, so I was thinking of putting a red envelope and putting like a scratcher or like a new dollar bill in it for good luck for this year. I also went to Urban Ritual and I also got these red envelopes. These are boba themed red envelopes and I wanted to add this into everyone's Valentine slash Lunar New Year goodie bag as well. That's all I had for the Lunar New Year haul. Now we'll be moving on to what I got for Valentine's Day. We'll start with what I'm planning planning to put into everyone's goodie bag. So the first thing I got, I always go to Dollar Tree for Valentine's Day or for any other holiday. They have the cutest buckets and like really cute like, what is it? Stuffers, stocking stuffers, but like holiday stuffers to put into your goodie bag. I got these buckets from Dollar Tree and I think they're the perfect size to put everything that I need to put into it. I was thinking of putting a soap into everyone's Valentine's Day bucket. I'm not sure how well it would be to use, but I thought it'd be cute for Valentine's Day decorating for your bathroom. Next for their stocking stuffer, I got these at Urban because I have a $5 coupon. I think these would be useful because I use these a lot and my friends also use this a lot. Jaisa actually introduced me to it, so... I've been using it and now Kara uses it so we all use it so I think these would be useful and I wanted their stocking stuffers or their holiday their valentine's day stuffer to be filled with stuff that's useful I love Visa I got us all matching necklaces these were three for ten dollars and they're in the shape of hearts I also got these mini valentine pails I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them I'm probably just going to put like a bucket in a bucket so like it's like bucketception I don't know, but I thought I'd get like a matching mini bucket to put into their already small bucket. I got these last year, but I saw them again, so I wanted to add these onto everyone's goodie bag for this year. Of course, we can't forget gnomes. I got all my Biffles gnomes. I don't know why gnomes are a thing now. I see them at like every store, so I had to get these gnomes. I got these at Target because I didn't find any of the big gnomes at Dollar Tree this year. Each Dollar Tree also varies, so I went to like two or three and I couldn't find them. So I settled with the small ones from Target. In addition to those gnomes, I also got gnomes, picket gnomes. I was thinking of adding pink hand sanitizers. Also, I have the champagne toes, rose water and ivy. I also got this one from Target. I can't think of stores today. I got so many in the Michaels grab bag last year so I've been using a different one every year because I just got so many. I got a puzzle one. I got a pun one. This also makes tattoos oh how cool and then i have stickers i really like the sticker ones i also like the puzzles one. Oh, this one is amazed i also found these balloons from dollar tree i was thinking of cutting it shorter so it looks cuter inside the pail they had different designs i was thinking of keeping one for myself because i thought it was really cute so i think i'm going to keep this one so that's why i got an extra of this one i got pink and white shred to mix together so the items like pop out more. The last thing I got were gift bags with tissue paper. It was already pre-made so it's going to look like this and then I also got this really nice tissue paper, this heart-shaped tissue paper from Kohl's. Before I forget, I always write Valentine's Day cards or any cards for any holiday occasion so this year I got these mini Valentine's Day cards. There's different types of the small Valentine's Day cards that I could choose from. I also got a postcard for my godmother. I was planning to give it to her in person so it's just going to be late or I could ship it to her but my brother still has to sign it. This one says sending valentine's wishes from here to there so I thought it'd be cute because we're like six hours away so it'd be nice to send it to her. That's all I had for my goodie bags and now I'll be showing you guys what I was planning to decorate my apartment with. From the Dollar Tree I got this to hang in my apartment as well as this one. So this one you can hang it or you can leave on your counter. I was thinking of leaving it on my counter but if I find a place to hang it I will hang this one. I also got this from the Dollar Tree. I thought it was a really nice like white and pink aesthetic and I really like the design for it so I was thinking of hanging this on my door or my wall. Next from Hobby Lobby I got this Valentine's Day decor. This is the kissing booth decor. I thought this was the cutest out of all the things I could find at Hobby Lobby so I wanted to get this one for my counter. I got this candy jar from Hobby Lobby as well. I think I'm going to put M&Ms in here though because I think that's the smallest thing that will fit in here. I only have Halloween theme color M&Ms or maybe I can wait until like Valentine's Day sale is on. After Valentine's Day it's only like two more days. I got this house from Target. Isn't it so cute? Oh my gosh. I really like the white, the pink. Oh, it's 
so pretty. I was planning on putting this on my kitchen counter as well. Maybe I can put like little snow so it's like really cute like you're walking through the snow to this house. At Target, I also found this makeup sponge brush washing machine that I saw I think on TikTok or YouTube and I want to get this. Well, actually, this is the first Target I've seen had this. I want to show you guys this because the one at Urban, people say breaks a lot. So when they have this at Target, I want to try it and it has this little tube so you can put out all your makeup water right here. the time float on cool air blows a memento as I fall behind I'm so sorry for dreaming about the future Take apart all the good things Stripped away what's there to do So many times I try But I just don't 